Since ancient times, yogis have placed immense importance on the space between the two eyebrows. This area is believed to be the seat of the soul. I would say the seat of the spirit, but this is another topic that we will discuss later. The final gland, a pea-sized organ located between the two hemispheres of the brain, is often referred to as one of the chakras, specifically the Ajna chakra, represented by two petals symbolizing the brain's hemispheres. This gland is considered a source of the mystical dimension of our lives. The mystical pineal gland the pineal gland holds many mysteries apart from eye cells. Pineal gland cells are also light sensitive, regulating our biological clock by sensing light and darkness. At night, when we close our eyes, the pineal gland releases melatonin, a hormone that regulates our sleep wake cycle. Loads of adepts see an invisible hole in this region that emits a luminous coronal light. By focusing on this light, one can perceive beings between Earth and higher planes and the casual. This gland connects individuals to higher realms. It's one of the glands of communication, of perception. Similarly, Maharshi Patanjali, in the third chapter of Yog Sutra, Sutra 32 states, Ordajyotishi Siddha Darshanam, meaning, focusing on this coronal light enables the vision of Siddhas, the lights and beings. In fact, as you ascend, different beings will be attracted to you in a positive and in a negative way. The famous visitations are a clear sign of spiritual progression. There are different techniques to activate the pineal gland. 1. Awareness on your forehead. Our body responds to where our attention goes. By bringing awareness to the forehead, particularly the space between the eyebrows, you can enhance the functioning of the pineal gland. Practices include Applying a mark or symbol, like ladies putting Sindor, or men applying Tika, which helps maintain awareness. Yogic practices suggest a simple technique. Sit in a meditative pose, close your eyes and roll your eyes upward to focus on the space between your eyebrows. Initially this may cause a slight headache, but with practice it becomes comfortable and highly beneficial. 2. Light Management the pineal gland becomes active as the surroundings get darker. Modern lifestyles with prolonged exposure to artificial lights and screens disrupt this natural process. To support the pineal gland, dim lights at least an hour before bedtime. Avoid using mobile phones and computers an hour before sleep. Align your schedule with natural light patterns, ensuring adequate rest and reducing blue light exposure from screens. 
three eye exercises. Given the close association between the pineal gland and the eyes, keeping your eyes healthy is crucial. Perform Trataka eye exercises regularly. Look at your palm, then at a distant object repeatedly for 30-50 times. Rotate your eyes from right to left and vice versa. Move your gaze from one shoulder to the other. Focus on the tip of your nose, then the center of your eyebrows. These exercises strengthen the eye muscles and keep the pineal gland active and healthy. The pineal gland, often considered the seat of the soul, plays a significant role in our metaphysical and spiritual dimensions. By practicing techniques that activate this gland, we can unlock its full potential and experience profound spiritual growth. Additionally, we can easily engage in spiritual sexual encounters with succubi and incubi and through astral sex can be deeply pleasurable and transformative, enhancing both physical pleasure and spiritual enlightenment. The Temple's Temple